Hello and welcome again to another one of Sean Redux's Battlefield Play for Free Video Commentaries. If you have not checked out the game yet, go to battlefield.playforfree.com. Hello and welcome everyone. Of course, you know who I am. And I'm here to present to you another video of awesome awesomeness to help you decide whether or not you want this particular weapon. And to show you some of the pros and cons of this weapon. But before I get into the grime and grit of this primary weapon, I must first tell you who suggested this video. And they are... Yeah, yeah, so don't mess with us. Yeah, don't even think about it. Alright, well you both seem more like imps to me, so thank you for the intro, be gone now. You don't tell me what to do! Yeah, me neither! Oh, I see. I knew this was gonna happen. Good thing you guys are only three feet high. So hey, don't I'm just do gonna that. push Stop. you out the ah, door here. You and ah, wait, wait. There you go. You guys are gone. Bye. Okay. Now, getting back to the video at hand, the gun that I will be using today, in case you haven't already guessed it, is the Spass 12 Pump Shotgun. And of course, it's the elite version of the shotgun. And I hope you enjoy the video. Out of all the shotguns in Battlefield Play for Free, the SPAS-12 is the highest damaging shotgun out of all of them so far. Out of all the shotguns, the SPAS-12 is my personal favorite. But that doesn't mean it doesn't have some drawbacks to it. Due to the fact that it is a shotgun, its range is a bit limited in comparison to the other shotguns that are in Battlefield Play for Free. But keep in mind that being that this is the highest damaging shotgun, it kind of makes up for it. This shotgun is a great pump shotgun all around, whether you decide to use hip fire accuracy to get your shots, or aiming down sight to get more accurate shots when somebody's hiding behind corners or anything like that. Also, when aiming down the sight of the shotgun, it's not too bad either, and it doesn't get in your way of trying to make your accurate shot. The total amount of shells you get with the SPAS-12 is 48, and that's 12 shells loaded inside the shotgun. I also like the SPAS-12 because it gives off a very distinct, powerful shotgun sound that I absolutely love as well. Even though the damage can vary with this shotgun, ranging from 7 to maybe 21 to 22 damage per shell that hits your enemy, depending on the range and distance of your target, uh, for the most part, if you're shooting at your enemy up close and maintain to his center mass, um, you'll definitely kill him in one hit, no questions asked. Or, even at medium ranges, if you decide to aim down sight and hit the center mass of your target, you will kill them in one hit. Possibly even two if you're a little unlucky. However, if you're trying to use this pump action shotgun at farther ranges, uh, just forget about it because as with any other shotgun in Battlefield Play for Free, they're not designed to take on enemies from far distances. But, that's not the only negative aspect with the SPAS-12. Uh, due to the fact that it is a pump shotgun, you have to uh, take in consideration of the reload time of this shotgun is quite slow, and that's due to the fact that you have to load each shell individually that you fire. So, the reload time is really slow. However, there is a trick to get by that. Um, if you just need to reload a little bit of your shells and would like to cancel out, um, all you really need to do is just switch your weapons to either your pistol and then switch it back to your shotgun and you should be good to go and that cancels the reload action for this shotgun as well as the 870 combat shotgun so that's a little tip for you guys there of course the other thing with the shotgun is that it doesn't have the rate of fire like the semi-automatic shotguns where you can just keep clicking and maintaining accurate shots um, or it's not like the USAS-12 where it's fully automatic if you just lay down on the trigger. So the rate of fire is definitely not up there. Um, this is just a shotgun that is meant for sheer power. And if you use the shotgun right and you maintain your accuracy with it, you can be totally devastating to the enemy. Of course you don't want to engage in far range shootouts. You want to try and keep your enemies as close as possible when using the SPAS-12. That's where you'll see the shotgun really shine. So, like I was saying before, outside of that, the SPAS-12 is personally my favorite shotgun in Battlefield Play for Free to date. Um, due to the fact that it accommodates my play style as far as being able to go through, shoot an enemy, and being able to kill them from close to medium ranges with this shotgun if I maintain accurate shots. 
but once you get into the swing of things with this shotgun, you can kiss your USAS-12 goodbye. I feel that the SPAS-12 is also a very undermined shotgun in Battlefield play for free and definitely deserves a second look throughout the entire community. Especially the Elite's version, due to the high amount of damage. So just a quick recap with the SPAS-12. It's very powerful and it does maintain its accuracy over medium to close range and to be able to kill your shots in just one hit. Also, the accuracy is really nice for the shotgun, whether you decide to use hip fire or aiming down sight, you know, for a pump action shotgun. Just some of the negative aspects with it, of course you won't be able to maintain far range, you know, uh, shots with it and be able to kill your enemy effectively, so I wouldn't suggest doing that at all. You also have to take in consideration of the reload time is very slow, um, but you can cancel that out yet again with that trick I just told you in the video. And also just keep in mind that it doesn't have the rate, the better rate of fire like the other um, semi-automatic shotguns or like the fully automatic S USAS-12 shotgun. Like I said, the iron sight is pretty nice and when you aim down sight it doesn't take up your entire field of view which is also good. Also another thing to note, you'll see me jump around a little bit while I'm making my shots with a shotgun. So the nice thing about the shotgun um, is due to the fact whether you're on the ground or off the ground you still maintain good spread accuracy with the shotgun and being able to take out your targets. And not only that, but the reason why a lot of people jump with the shotgun is so that way it makes them a harder target to hit. So just food for thought there. But my final thoughts yet again, I absolutely love this shotgun. It is definitely my favorite shotgun in Battlefield play for free so far. And I highly suggest adding this one to your collection. Thanks again for watching. Uh, keep your video suggestions coming, and I'll see you guys next time. Oh, yeah.